Thank you all for tuning in, logging on to another episode of Illuminati News Hour, right here, Illuminati Radio. I'm your host, I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. If you are new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button, turn on your notification bell so you'll be notified when I drop this breaking news on you. Uh, don't forget, people, make sure you hit that like button as you guys come in here, because as you know, they censor in this channel. Yes, so I need you guys to hit that like button. All right, so let me tell you something, people. I'm your host, I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. And uh, Lula Nas X says that he, he feels like he's not respected in um, hip-hop. Um, Lula Nas X, you are highly respected in hip-hop. Lula Nas X, Lula do you, well, not Lula do you know, because you do know. You See, this is what you portray into the people. You know what I'm saying? It's the agenda that you're pushing. You know what I'm saying? You are telling the people, because you ain't telling yourself, you're telling the people that you feel that you are not being respected in hip-hop. So, let's see. Why do you feel that you're not being respected in hip-hop? Why? Because you're a man and you are openly uber duba 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 You're openly that, huh? So you are a man and you are openly, you know, um, woody doody do. Yeah, that's the woody doody do. You know, he's openly woody doody do. I'm going to say woody doody do because you know what I'm saying, the YouTube algorithms. You know what I'm saying? So he's openly woody doody do. And he's saying that he's not respected in hip hop. But you know, there's a whole lot of woody, actually, a hundred, a hundred percent. Of everybody in hip hop and in Hollywood, like yourself, a woody doody do. So, what are you not being respected for? You know what I'm saying? You know you're being respected because you know Hollywood and hip hop love the woody doody do's. You understand? But what you, the reason why you coming out and you saying this on your platform is because you want, you know what I'm saying, to see, because see, who is your music catered to? Let's see. Who is who is Little Nas X's core fan base? Who is Little Nas X's core fan base? Little Nas X's core fan base is children and semi adults. That you know, when I say semi adults, because I don't think any grown man with any common sense would even listen to Little Nas X. So I say semi-adults. You got to be a semi-adult to even listen to Lil Nas X. You got to be something like an adult. Not actual, not not an actual adult, but something like an adult. You know, kind of like the J-E-W-I-S-H. The reason why they put I-S-H at the end of J-E-W. Because they are something like the J-E-W. But they are not the J-E-W because the J-E-W's are black. <laughs> They're not Caucasian. So, but the J-E-W-I-S-H is the one that is running Hollywood. Is the one that is paying Little Nas X. Is the one that got Little Nas X on payroll to push the agenda and to spark the conversation for other little boys and girls. To cry out how they are not being respected because they are young and they want to identify as something that they was not born. Do you see what I'm saying? I'm going to say it like this. You have um, Dwayne Wade's son. He's a child. He's a child. Not even old enough to go to the liquor store and buy a bottle of liquor. He's a child, not even old enough to go to a bodega or a store and buy a pack of cigarettes. But yet, he's old enough somehow to claim to change his gender. See how, see how that work? So, see, it's all about controlling the masses' minds. And they use public figures like Lil Nas X to control the masses' minds. How do they use little people like Lil Nas X to control the masses' mind? By saying things like this. Oh, I'm not being respected. But even though I'm not being respected, I'm here to stay. So, let's see. 
the because this is this is mental brainwashing at its all time high. You want to know about MK Ultra mind control? This is witchcraft and voodoo they are using on your children's undeveloped mind. The reason why your children is okay with choosing who they are and not what they was born as. Why? Because their mind is undeveloped. And if you get a child in that feeble mind state, you can control that child in that feeble mind state. You see how that works? The reason why R. Kelly liked little girls and wanted to get little girls because he can control their mind at that feeble mind state. What the Bible says, raise up a child in the way that he or she may go, and when that child get older, he or she will never stray. So little Nas X, you may be fooling the world, but you ain't fooling me. You're not being respected in Hollywood? How? How you're not being respected in hip-hop? When almost every rapper, yes, thug or no thug, every rapper have to bend over and get butt broke. By who? The J-E-W-I-S-H. They literally have to do this. They literally have to bend over and get butt broke. The same, the same way we, when we came in on those plantations, that the first thing the slave master did was did what? Butt break us. You see? So, so what are you saying, little Nas X? You know what I'm saying? You ain't nothing but a paid off puppet. Paid off to do what? To coerce the masses. To brainwash the masses. To brainwash the masses. Little children and all. You know what I'm saying? Whoop they, they young feeble minds into the agenda that you're pushing. You're not being respected. Really, little Nas X? Really? See, you know, you, I know you and people like you want to get rid of people like me. Because, see, people like me reveals the truth about you, Lil Nas X. You ain't nothing but a puppet. And guess what? You can say you're not gay. Oh, oh sorry, I just said the name. You can say you're not woody doody doody all you want. You may not be. But when your assignment is all said and done, you damn sure is going to be. Why? Because you got to wait till your assignment is done. When your assignment is done, then you can come out and say whatever. But by the time your assignment is done, you done went through all sorts of things. <laughs> that hey, you might as well go ahead and you can't knock it till you try it. <laughs> anyway, people, this is another propaganda move for little Nas X. You know what I'm saying? To warp the minds of the young children and the feeble-minded semi-adults. You know what I'm saying? That's all that is. To make the adults feel if they if they want to be the same way little Nas X is, they want the little adults and the feeble young minded men to, you know what I'm saying, push that same agenda. Oh, you gonna respect me. If I'm a man and I wanna have titties, you gonna respect me. If I'm a man and I want to change my gender and take and get my my private part taken off and and turn into a JJ, then you're gonna respect me. That's what it's all about. It's all about not you, little Nas X, but the people that follow you, the children that look up to you, to believe and to push. You know what I'm saying? To to cry out. To be respected as being abnormal. That's what that is. But anyway, people, this is news. I want to thank you all for tuning in logging on to another episode of Illuminati News Hour. Right here on Illuminati Radio, I am your host. I'm your pastor, Mr. Michael Smith. If you are new to this channel, please hit that subscribe button. Turn on your notification bell so you'll be notified when I drop this breaking news on you. Um, don't forget, people, uh, make sure you hit that like button as you guys come in here because, as you know, that's sort of the Facebook algorithm. And if you want to donate to this ministry, support this ministry, 
The PayPal link is in the description box below. Till next time, stay tuned. God bless you.